FPS and how do you get better FPS because everybody ask me about FPS and FPS this, FPS that. Why you got good FPS? Why do I have bad FPS? FPS, yes. I'm gonna show you how you can get stable 30 FPS in your game because, yeah, why not? So basically, I have figured out some ways to have a stable FPS, 30 FPS, and I don't know why anyone has not figured this out yet. It's pretty simple. I'm gonna go over the few tips, or not tips, I'm gonna go over the few tricks that I use to get a better FPS. You're not gonna get like 40 FPS, you're not gonna get 60 FPS, you're gonna get 30 FPS and 30 FPS only because it's Nintendo Switch. But yeah, if you haven't yet, make sure you like, subscribe, and you know, hit the bell. And if you wanna follow me on any of my social medias, they're gonna be in the description because yeah, I just recently made them, so you know, you can you can just follow those and it'll be great. So basically I turned down my HUD scale to 0.50. It's you can still see it in game. It's just everything is smaller and it makes the game run better when everything's smaller. It it does less processing and stuff like that. So I'd recommend turning it down to 0.50. This is what it looks like. I know you can't read my name, it that doesn't matter if you if you're not a streamer, that shouldn't matter to you. I am a streamer, I just type my name in the chat. But all that matters is you can see your health bar, you can still see your mini map, you can still see your guns and your building mechanics and stuff like that. And that's all that matters, right? The second thing you wanna do to get better FPS is turning off all the HUDs that don't really do anything. So stuff that you don't really care about, you wanna turn off, cause it draws FPS and less stuff that's on your screen will help you help your game run smoother if you know what i mean so what i have off of the vehicle controls i barely even use vehicles so and i already know what buttons is it, it is to get off the vehicles and stuff i turn off like the, the random stuff like the the quest stuff like the the challenges i don't even do challenges um the net bug statics this is like a ping and stuff like that it shows you your ping you don't really you you get everyone gets the same amount of ping it's stupid like we we all get like 60 ping um elimination fee i don't really care who i kill um backpack keys i don't even know what that is uh pick up loot stream i don't know what that is so i just turn it off stuff that i don't need i keep on only the important stuff so basically this whole row you could i used to play without mini map i used to play without reticles so you can turn that off the more things you turn off obviously the better your fps is going to be that's less stuff that's on the board all right these last couple of things i'm going to show you is has to do in the nintendo switch settings so this is why my screen is a lot smaller than usual and i play on like different settings in my home screen so i'm just going to get right into those all right so what you want to do is you want to go to your tv settings all right um, I have my TV resolution to 720p. I, I'm pretty sure everyone already runs on 720p. Um, if you're still on 1080p, you're you're doing it wrong. Uh, I play my play on limited range. Um, basically, the reason for this is because I don't want like details and stuff to pop up in the background uh, that draws FPS. Um, also, another thing to get better FPS: the smaller the screen is. So basically, what I'm saying is. Um, if you have a monitor, right, or a TV, and you make your screen smaller on that monitor, it is gonna make the details and stuff a lot smaller, right? And since this is on Nintendo Switch, this is an actual setting in Nintendo Switch. So this is gonna help Nintendo Switch run better in a way. So yeah, just, yeah, this this is just a, a little thing that I do to help my FPS out. All the rest of the stuff doesn't matter. This is just my normal layout of what I have. Um, yeah. So everyone's saying, oh, why don't you use visual sound effects? You can see where they are, you can see all this crap. The reason I don't use it is because it lowers your FPS. It gives you worse FPS. Like, it's been proven that it gives you worse FPS. Like, a lot of the big streamers like Tifu, all of them, anyone on PC, anyone on PlayStation, they don't use it for the reason that it, it drops your FPS. So that's the reason I don't use this. So maybe turning that off will help you get better FPS. 
I know a lot of people are gonna be like, oh, that doesn't do anything. None of this stuff does anything. It doesn't help you have PS or any of that. Honestly, just try it for yourself and let me know in the comments what you think. Cause I've been running on these settings and my streams have been a lot better. Um, people have been saying that I've been playing on like 200 FPS on this handle switch, that's crazy. But um, yeah, honestly, just try it for yourself. Let me know. Um, yeah, that's all I can say. You, you can't really like say anything until you actually try it. Um, I'm trying to help out the Switch community, um, you know. And if you enjoy, make sure you like and subscribe. Hit the post notifications, you know, so we can so we so we can get some more videos like this out there, you know. Um, I'm gonna try and make some more videos for you guys like this. I want to do some more high ground retake videos. I I don't have any high ground retake videos. Why did I say more? Yeah, I want to make some high ground retake videos for you guys. All right, that's better. Let me know. I already said that. The flow. All right. But if you did enjoy, make sure you like, subscribe, and hit the post notifications. Thank you for watching, and see you in the next stream or video. Wait, I gotta do the the Fortnite way.